hello guys welcome back so one thing which I have to mention here is that first of all in this video we are going to fix the player movement now I think you have noticed that when the player has no weapon in his arms then you can see that the player can move uh, in a correct way okay probably the player can move forward backward left side right side but as soon as the player has any weapon out and then when you f move forward then the player move in the uh, you know like not fully straight you can see that it is moving like a uh, curve in a curve so we have to fix this also the left and right and the backward direction is uh, not okay when the player has a weapon in his arm so we have to fix this so how we can fix that is you can just go to the FPS blueprints and inside the FPS blueprints where we have our my FPS character in here go to the viewport and this camera to which our this uh, FPS arms are attached which is this okay click on this camera and you can see that this is our collider so we have to move this camera in front of this collider okay as this is our first character so when we move this okay just click on this camera and you will see these arrows okay XYZ axis so just drag it from here and move it forward in front of this uh, this collider like this okay as you can see we have move it forward just like this so once you do that then you can simply click on this save button and come back to the game let's test the game and now let's check it so now if I take out any gun and now if I move forward then you can see that it is moving in a proper direction backward right left similarly let's test it for the assault rifle so if I move forward then in the forward still there is a problem that it is moving slowly however the backward left and right is working fine now only the forward has uh, I mean we have to fix it so the same idea is that we have to just move these arms a little bit forward okay like this the camera must be like this in front of this collider save this and let's test take out the assault rifle so now it is okay you can see that the player can move now in a correct way okay the player can move freely now come back here to the my fps character and we have to select this fps skeletal mesh arms so you can see that when you click on that this appears okay which is for these arms so this uh, you have to make sure that it is at the minus 75 okay that is here which is the default location for this let me move it you will see it okay minus 75 I hope you can see that and then uh, drag it from here a little bit forward like this okay a little forward only one time let me show you the values like this okay minus 0.00, .00 as you can see minus 0, 0.00 move it a little bit forward let's just compile and save and see how it looks so now you can see the hand appears so if we press 2 then this is for the gun which looks good and then also if we check it for the assault rifle then for the assault rifle it looks like this as you can see we have to just uh, fix this left arm that is move this arm little bit downward okay so for that purpose we will go to the arms animation which is inside the character hero fpp and this arms animation open it up and for the arms animation as you can see this one is for the assault rifle okay assault rifle animation so what we can do is first you have to make sure that weapon type current 
so the current weapon type we have to select for here assault rifle as we are doing the changes for the assault rifle so what we can do now is that just select this one which is for the assault rifle okay this is the left shoulder as you know that already so it will show you these arrows okay that is XYZ axis we will move it little bit downward okay then we will compile and then we will save and let's see how it looks for the assault rifle now so it looks like this let's move it a little bit further down and by the way you can see the values here okay when we change it so anyways let's move it a little bit brown then compile then save and you can change the values from here okay you can see the result here however you can also drag it from here as well so it is totally up to you so now now it looks good as you can see So now it's good okay you can see now both hands one is on the trigger and the other one is on the gun in order to control similarly for the rifle it also looks good as you can see that finger on the finger on the rifle now one thing if you want is if you for the rifle okay for the rifle we have this one uh, sorry for the pistol okay when I say rifle by rifle I simply mean the assault rifle which is car H and when I say pistol pistol simply means the this one okay so currently we were doing it for the assault rifle as we selected the assault rifle animation okay so as you see that for the assault rifle it looks like this which is okay now okay which is perfect now the next thing that we will do is for the pistol so for the pistol first you have to choose the pistol so it will start playing the pistol animation which you can see here now for the pistol if you do not want this hand then you can move it backward okay and you will see only that one hand which is there for example let me show you I will just click here and I will move this left hand backward okay like this so in the view now if I compile and save in the view if I play the game and now take out gun then it will look like this as you can see only this one finger uh, on the trigger of course you can fix this uh, gun location further which I already told you guys in the previous video so it is totally up to you guys okay how you want to I mean put this second hand okay so I think this location is also okay and if you do not see the gun in the view then it is okay okay this is totally fine we just want we have to just take care of the values not this this is just a preview okay to some of you it will show and to some of you it will, it will not show this uh, pistol okay it will not show this pistol in the view so it is totally fine just take care for the pistol this is all the values and for the assault rifle these are the values for the arms so anyways let's just save first of all make sure that you close okay then compile save compile save and let's see for the assault rifle and for the weapon so for the uh, for the pistol so for the pistol you can see that it is okay now and then for the assault rifle you can see that it looks more good now So yeah, that's it.